Morning everyone, welcome to the Sydney Cricket Ground. You join us for this 2020 match between India and Sri Lanka. I'm Mike Atherton and with me for this exciting contest is Mel Jones, Ali Mitchell, Ian Healy and the one and only David Gower. Well, thanks others for such a glowing introduction. Earlier, I took a look at the conditions and the pitch has been prepared beautifully, something for everyone. I'd say it's worth getting at the batters with the ball first though. A bit of cloud hanging around, but nothing to worry the ground. Not sure what's running through the captain's minds here. This pitch will only get easier to bat on, so why bat now? The bowlers could have a field day. Here we go, first ball of the match. Nothing better than getting a game started and hearing the sound of leather on Willow. Right on. Look up. Quick onto that in the infield. Good runs, good shot, first ball of the innings. A lot of pressure coming to the crease. Not had the best of weeks leading up to this game and will want to show everyone their strength. Up, up. There'll be one run here for them. And they're away and nicely off the mark. Only a touch full and put away. Yep. Super yeah. First wicket's down. Back to the pavilion and disappointment is etched on their face. Can't believe they got out like that. Doesn't beat the infield. That's the over. Sri Lanka, 96 for one. Edged it. Strong appeal. And gone, didn't even wait for the umpire's decision. They will receive now the warmest of receptions from this crowd for a supreme display of batting. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Really? That's just wasting everyone's time. Deceived by the drift, beaten by the spin, it's as simple as that really. Six runs added there. Sri Lanka are 105 for two. Yeah. Good running, just finding the gap and that allows for rotation of the strike and keep pressure on the bowlers. Yeah, yeah. Super shot that. Fine placement and enough timing to get that ball away to the boundary. I'd like to see them aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Oh, that's a great catch. An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. The field will come up now, you'd think. Pressure should definitely be on the new batter, who strides to the middle. They'll be looking for another quick wicket. Driven off the front foot, fantastic cricket shot, probably expected more there. And gone! Yeah. Amazing work from the keeper. Another one gone, the fourth wicket is in the bag. A bit of trouble if there was another to fall quickly. We've seen some very good bowling. Huge edge! Four runs added in that over. Sri Lanka, 146 for four. Well, a decent score here, but they need a strong showing with the ball to bring this home. The openers are coming out to begin the chase. A few early boundaries will help settle things down. The bowlers will only need a sniff to get back in the game. Good bit of timing there. Onto the front foot early, placed it perfectly into the gap. Timed it nicely for four more. A beauty, yeah. brilliant catch. Oh dear, it's been a poor innings under pressure, and now they've got the key batter out cheaply. Yep, great shot. 
Well, a lovely shot, really good timing, out of the middle, and race to the boundary. Yep. Great shot, great timing. It was just a little bit too full, and it was beautifully timed. A brilliant over for the batting side, not so for the bowlers. The left arm medium bowler is coming into the attack, in the Paddington end. That was a tremendous delivery, fizzed through to the keeper. No more short balls this over. A change to the complexion of this match. Got to get the new batter coming forward early, encouraging them to drive and really attack the stumps. Onto the front foot, super shot, should be four. No! Good return, back from the deep. And with that, they're off the mark. Yeah. There'll be one run here for them. Good precision with the throw, back from the deep. Tucked it nicely into the gap. Pick up a single, rotate the strike. Yep, yep. Picks the gap perfectly. You can't fault that shot. Nicely played, and it was four runs all the way. Just need to keep it simple. Line and length, around about off stump, and that'll force the mistake. Smeared away. Don't think it'll go all the way. No trouble at all to punch it away to the boundary for four. A poor delivery. Yep, yep. I think that's called for the front foot. Not by much, but that doesn't matter. Always difficult to focus after what happened last ball. But you just got to stay positive and believe the wicket will come. Yep. Times it nicely. That went all the way up toward the grandstand for four. Driven away nicely. That's off the middle of the bat. You could see by how it whistled away to the boundary just how sweetly this was timed. Playing all their shots in that over, a very expensive over. Yep, yep. Got hold of it, a pretty good bouncer, enough control to get it away. That races away to the boundary, a beautiful shot off the front foot, just textbook stuff. Yep. Good running, just finding the gap, and that allows for rotation of the strike and keeping pressure on the bowlers. trouble here they make it home but there should never have been the chance of a run out in the first place oh, unable to get the scoreboard moving yep collects that one simple as you like inside the ring manipulating the field asking questions of the opposition captain as they take a single end of the over six off it India are 44 for one Good running, just finding the gap, and that allows for rotation of the strike and keeps the pressure on the bowlers. Yep, two full, got what it deserved. Well, that was a really solid shot. Read the length early to get onto the front foot, and that raced away for four. Yep, yep, too good. Not sure anyone is going to cut that off. I, for one, reckon that second run was on, but clearly the batters knew better. Just a little bit wide, well picked up. And let the ball do all the work, really, just to nudge it down towards third. Yep. Oh, my yeah. word, what a catch. The hang time on that one. Well, the end of a productive innings. It didn't quite ignite into fireworks as we would have hoped, but still, solid work. Yep. Beautifully played through the leg side off the back foot. Got it well enough to get it away to the boundary, a poor delivery, and a fine shot in the end. 11 runs added there. India are 55 for two. A new bowler is coming into the attack. That's a tough call for the bowler. I thought that was there to be hit. Nice shot. Just need one of the cameramen to send that one back. A little bit of width, but clinically put away. Power and precision in that shot. Quick to get onto that sweep. It was beautifully placed and beautifully struck for four. Really good shot there. Tried to take the pace off by rolling the fingers across the seam. It's a great shot. Didn't take a lot of effort to get it away. Couldn't have played that any better. Found the gap with ease. Wasn't the worst ball you'll see, but it's still raced to the rope. Yep. 
That's four. No one at third man to stop it. That really wasn't a great delivery. Seen early, and it was dispatched with a plum. Struck it nicely. Could go to the boundary. It was in the gap, pretty much all the way along the ground to the boundary rope. Off to a good start now. Really playing all their shots that over. Really expensive. Yep, yep. Head over the ball. Great shot. That's racing away. Well, that was a poor delivery. You can't bowl there, and it got what it deserved. Direct hit, and this could be gone. Gone, brilliant in the field. A fluent innings undone by a decent delivery. A good wicket to get at a good time. Big opportunity. They've worked hard in recent weeks. They should have the confidence to build an innings and get big runs on the board. And the chance goes begging. Yeah, good shot. A beauty. That really wasn't a great delivery. Seen early, and it was dispatched with a plum. India weren't given much of an opportunity, a very tidy over. The right armour is coming on to bowl, and the Randwick end. Decisive running might have gotten to. Uh, looking back at it, I'd say they'd have made it easily, so in the end, poor running. Very quick out there, managing to stop it and preventing four runs. Yep. Precision, past the umpire and not likely to get cut off. There was minimal follow-through, just great timing to punch it through the field for four. It can be very disheartening seeing good deliveries smacked around. Sometimes you've just got to accept it and move on. That's a much better directed short ball. Didn't quite manage to get the bat in position, it's through to the keeper. That's the one bouncer for the over. Oh my, that's racing away. This batter really is the key now. Picking up the boundaries when they need them, just the sort of thing the team needs. End of the over, ten runs coming from it. India, 98 for three. Yeah. Managed to get off the front foot early, and just incredible power to lock that one over the boundary. That last ball isn't something you'd want to see a repeat of. You don't want to be giving easy runs away. Well, another chance to bowl that one. Really can't have been wide by much, though. Yep, yep. Lovely shot. Good seam position, but overpitched and got what it deserved. Well, it was hammered away, timed perfectly and placed into the gap. Yep. Saw that early. No one's catching that. Great shot. The fielder could only pick that up off the boundary rope. Punch that away through the covers with exquisite timing. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. Well, for a brief moment, you thought there might be a bit of strife there. In the end, a good decision not to take on the field. Wait! Just can't seem to get the ball away. That's the third dot. Questions will begin to be asked. Should the captain make a change? A big over that one. Too many loose deliveries. That's the one and only short one for the over. Always good to throw it in. Hey, nice volley. That's the end of the over, one run coming from it. India, 118 for three. The right armour is coming into the attack, and the Paddington end. 
just about timed that perfectly. Got their head right in line with the ball, a beautiful strike there, down the ground. Yep. Immaculate timing there. Well, it's a case of blinking you miss it with this innings. 50 brought up, and what a devastating passage of play it's been. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. One little front foot shot, and there was absolutely no point in chasing that. Got yep. that away nicely. No! A brilliant throw in from the deep caps off what was a fabulous piece of fielding. That's the 50 partnership between these two, gaining some momentum nicely for the team. Oh, yep. A bit of a mix-up, they'll need to improve their communication. Nicely played, perfect timing. Fine placement and enough timing to get that ball away to the boundary. Yep. Good shot, he's found the gap. No! A couple on offer here. Good throw from the deep, on target. You can understand why on that line they thought it was safe to let it straight through to the keeper. End of the over, 7 off. India, 141 for 3. The right arm fast bowler is coming into the attack from the Paddington end. Pads that one. Loud appeal! They're thinking long and hard on this one, it's close, but I think it's hitting. Looking good so far, no issue with the bounce. Certainly no issue with the line. That's going on to hit the wickets. That review is not the greatest. This innings cut short before it could really take off. They'll be disappointed they couldn't go on and score a big one. Not the best decision to review that. The umpire has got it spot on. Yep. Into the gap, nice shot. Nothing wrong with that shot. Getting their eye in straight away, and that's raced for four. in the slot, right where they like it. The ball races to the boundary. That was a mighty win. Really too easy to score runs, and they chased down that total.